Ukrainian family that escaped the war just two hours after it started are celebrating their first Thanksgiving with a family living in Ovens. A sister, mother, father, and several children escaped the war-torn country, leaving everything they owned behind. 10 TV reporter Kevin Landers has their story. Mm -hmm. Thanksgiving will mean more this year. I'm ready. In Sophia Spencer's home. The pumpkin's already baked and peeled and ready. The Ukrainian-born former Marine is celebrating for the first time with her mother, father, sister, and her sister's children. All of them escaped from war-torn Ukraine. As soon as they announced the war, they only had two hours to escape. Her sister, Irina Delakova, and her two children and husband lived in the small city of Ismail, south of Odessa, where they owned a meat-smoking business and quail farm. This map shows the journey they had to take to get to Columbus. They left in February and arrived in Ohio in April. When asked about her country, it's still hard for her to talk about. I miss Ukraine. I would like to go back, and I want it to be safe. But even though if it's over, I would still want to be here, not because of the where I'm at, but because I'm with family. When asked what it means to live in America, the gratitude was clear. Uh, it means a whole lot. First of all, it's safety. And I'm finally close to my loved ones. This reunion is also hard because so many of their Ukrainian friends are stuck and cannot leave. It's bittersweet because I have cousins there, I have classmates, I have friends, co-workers. Outside the home, they proudly fly the U.S. and Ukrainian flag. Two cultures coming together with the hope others who fear for their lives in Ukraine can escape the horrors of war. What's your message to Vladimir Putin if you could speak to him? This is no way, by no means, okay. Kevin Landers, 10TV News.